down in th the top field pits with Terry McMillan. Second race now with this new Morgan Lucas Racing chassis, but it hasn't been an easy weekend for you guys so far. What issues have you had? You know, it's not it's not the car's fault at all. You know, we just have a uh, an issue with the clutch flow right now, and uh, the number three flow has just been acting strange. So we bypassed it, went around, moved all the other flows around, and uh, now we're just trying to figure out what that number three flow needs again because every time we get to that point on the track, it wants to blow the tires off. So I think we got a handle on it now. Hopefully, we'll go out there and uh, still run a, like a low 80, and and uh, but the car's been fast up to that point all weekend long faster than what it did when we ran the 80 in Pomona so I'm really um, hopeful that we'll uh, have the combination my guy's been working hard to figure that out I think we're good good news for this weekend though you're gonna be in the show regardless but the car is still black and the next race that we go to it's the Gator Nationals it's your sponsors event what are you looking forward to well I promise you the car won't be black <laughs> but I uh, you know we got a whole new wrap uh, car leaves here let's go right to the uh, graphics company Ray and then uh, Ray will get it all wrapped up for us and uh, we'll reveal the uh, new look in uh, in Gainesville but uh, you know, it's a big race for us I mean we sponsor the race and uh, you know I think we have about 1400 of our closest friends and uh, business partners coming in with us so it's gonna be an exciting weekend and certainly uh, gives me goosebumps thinking about it but uh, right now we gotta we gotta get this race underneath our belt we gotta get this hot rod down the track so that we can uh, maintain a position and stay in that number and get up to that number 10 spot so that uh, we can fight this thing in any lot well, of things to look forward to thank you thank you big time fluid out of the right side of terry mcmillan's car he's up against tony schumacher is that an issue mike uh could be if it doesn't drop could have a no nozzle hung open and putting a little bit too much fuel in that thing at the hit if it picks it up it'll be all right Nope, pick it up. Now the question is, what kind of number will the Sarge run? Three, seventy, five, seven. There we go. Seven. About time. He's a top half qualifier for the first time in the last three races, trying to buck a streak, which he did, of qualifying in the bottom half, three consecutive races. The last time he did that, at the end of the 98 season. Boy, that could be a get healthy run there. Oh, they needed this. And take another look at uh, Terry McMillan. We saw the cylinders problem. As soon as he hit the throttle, it was out. It, those cylinders never lit. Just had too much fuel going into it. Like I said, probably had a nozzle that's normally supposed to be closed till the driver hits the throttle. It must have been, it might have been hung open, allowing way too much fuel in there, and it just went out there. And probably got some fuel on the tires and went up in smoke. But Tony Schumacher made a, <laughs> a get healthy run right there. It's also called the number two qualifying spot.